Gear up for the ultimate overlanding showcase. We're diving into the top builds from a beastly Jeep to a truck with a custom flatbed that redefines adventure. Check out the Jeep with its own fireplace and stick around till the end for the ultimate overlanding motorhome. These transformations are absolutely incredible. I've definitely scratched it up and put a couple dings into the, the flatbed, the camper, the sliders, all that good stuff. And the truck itself is a third gen Tacoma. It's a TRD off-road long bed. So it's got that locking rear diff as well as a six foot bed. I know a lot of people that build out Tacomas tend to stick to a short bed. But for me, having that long bed just made more sense. Having the extra storage, the extra length, the bigger camper, and especially having the ability to sleep inside the camper with it shut was really important to me. Hi there, I'm Judith. And I'm Martha. Welcome to our home on wheel Yoda. So this is our rig. It's called Yoda um, because when we bought the truck, uh, it was still in army green. It's a 30-year-old uh, Steyr 12M18. They used to build these for the Austrian army. We bought it from the company XCAP. It weighs about 11 and a half tons. We have a Conti HCS, which is a decent off-road tire. I'm Lucy with Ross Monster and this is the latest Baja truck camper to leave the shop. This Baja truck camper is built on an F350 Lariat. It's an eight foot bed. Design highlights of this vehicle include Sugar Shack mint upholstered wall and ceiling panels. All of our cabinetry is gonna be maple slab door. We have paper stone azure countertops. And then we have a Crest leather upholstered rear dinette. This is gonna be in the English saddle color. My name is Isabel and today I'll be giving you a tour of the Chevy 1.0. This Chevy 1.0 is a Chevrolet Silverado, a 2500 HD model of the year 2020. We worked very closely with the client. This vehicle has now become the perfect vehicle for this adventurous family to tackle the toughest terrains. I will be highlighting the Storyteller Overland GXV Hilt. Because this is a Storyteller Overland product, this is the newest vehicle in their lineup. For the chassis of the Hilt, Storyteller opted to build these things onto the Ram 5500 chassis, which comes with a 6.7 liter diesel. Trucks like this are obviously built for towing and hauling around some pretty heavy gear. Mountain passes seem to be no problem. And of course, when you have a giant capsule on the back, I think they did a really good job at selecting the initial platform to build this first initial truck on. Hi, I'm Lindsay, and this is my Overland Explorer X10 flatbed camper. I've been traveling solo for four and a half years and in this rig for two years. So come on inside while I show you around. Hi, I'm Judd, the owner of Adrenaline Industries, and I'm here today to introduce to you all our newest Overland Series build. This one is more of the expedition vehicle, yep. overlander, comfortable camper. Yep. Yep. Okay, well let's dive into uh, some of the things that you've done for it. First of all, what model Jeep is this? It is a 2021 Gladiator diesel. So I did go with the diesel. It is a Rubicon model and it's got the 3.0 uh, diesel engine in it. I went to that for fuel economy and torque and a few other things. And I just really want, I like the idea of having a diesel. Yeah, and what color? Hydro blue. Hydro blue, dude, I love the yeah. color, man. It looks so good. It, it does. It does look 